Deborah wrote me an email that said, um, you know, we'd be honored if you would write and direct the Harriet and um, the Harriet Tubman movie. And it was, I, I was dancing around the house. <laughs> I, told, I told, told my husband, Fonda, you know, like, I got, I got Harriet. And it was this great um, moment for me. Because by that point, though I'd been trying not to think about it too hard, um, I didn't want to overly invest in the possibility in case it didn't happen. I was so scared of being disappointed. Um, I didn't allow myself to fully kind of think through what it would mean to direct the movie. So then all of a sudden I have to um, deal with the, the real weight of um, history, you know, and this legacy and such an important person and, um, and yet what an opportunity. Even though we have in our minds this must have been an incredibly fierce human being, the images we see of her are um, almost sweet, right? Um, and we're so familiar, they're familiar. And so to me, it was an opportunity to present this kind of um, superhero woman, like a real American hero, but also kind of this, um, this woman that existed outside of the realm of ordinary limitations. And so here's Cynthia, you know, and she's, she's fierce and she's tiny and she's uh, strong and powerful and she's filled with this energy um, this beautiful, beautiful energy and humanity. And uh, you feel her soaring soul when you talk to her. And so, um, I mean, that's a question in your mind when you take on um, a subject like this, is who's going to play Harriet Tubman? And um, quite honestly, I didn't think that there were that many people that could do it justice, especially at this point in her life as a young woman, you know? And um, as soon as I met Cynthia, I knew that she could do it. The sets are beautiful and the costumes are beautiful and um, the props are beautiful. Steve George is doing props, They're, you know, so it, it adds a lot. There's a lot of texture and um, just what you would want in a film like this, a lot of uh, rich texture. You know, everything goes together to help tell the story. So you really have a feeling that you are in a place and time. Right now, to be working with two women producers, that's incredible. It feels incredibly powerful to us, you know, um, that this film is headed by three women. You know, it's something we're very proud of. Um, it's something we're very proud of, and we, and we feel it's um, appropriate, you know? It's appropriate for, for us to be doing this movie at this time. It feels... Um, it feels like the right thing at the right time, at the right moment in history, frankly. So to me, it was is a story of, of tenacity and human courage and, and strength and purpose and drive and um, you know, all the wonderful things that you can that you can say about a human being are kind of embodied in Har Harriet Tubman, this incredible integrity and um and her humanity, people that talk, that contemporaneously wrote about her, um, talked about her humanity and her warmth, you know? And so to get all of that in this woman, um, you know, to see what's behind her magnificent face and this kind of wonderful scowl that she has, you know, in, in so many pictures, she's got a seriousness of a life lived and to kind of be able to say, no, this is, this is how she got to be this person to see a story of human courage, of course, is always um, incredibly inspiring. But a woman, um, a woman who is this brave and this strong and this single-minded and this, uh, this courageous, you know, I think it's a wonderful time for that. It's a wonderful time to celebrate womanhood. It's a wonderful time to celebrate American heroes and, um, and courage you know, and activism. You know, she had to act. She acted. That's what she did. Nothing stopped her. Nothing stopped her. She didn't see uh, any limitation to what she could do, what she could accomplish, and how she could help, you know, her fellow man. And so I think that's, I mean, I think it's great. I think you'll come out uplifted, and I think you'll come out inspired. 
And I think you'll come out knowing things you didn't know before. And um, moved, incredibly moved, and optimistic. Everything goes together to help tell the story. So you really have a feeling that you are in a place and time, you know, um, and a varied experience from from you know the southern kind of farms and plantations to Philadelphia, where where we're we're shooting now in Petersburg for Philadelphia, and this is kind of you know the big city, and um, navigating those looks and and how that feels, how it feels. Um, to escape, you know, to escape slavery in the country and and be up north in the city. And that's really uh, captured by my collaborators, you know. <laughs>